In this video, I'm going to show you how to lace up your heavy winter boots quickly and efficiently with uh, light gloves on. It's a bit of a process. How you do it when you're warm versus you're cold is very different. So I'm going to just tilt the camera down and show you my lacing process. That way you get a good idea how to do this in the winter. Because I'm out here winter camping. And uh, just to prove that I'm winter camping, there's the winter. You can see it out there. You can see the snow here, so I'm not at home. And do not try this at home, kids. So what I do is I tilt my foot back as far as possible. That's a key thing. And I get the first laces set. And then instead of crossing hand hand, all I do is weave, 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 and weave. Weave, 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 and weave. And then I make sure my foot is tilted as high as possible. That way I don't hurt my Achilles in the middle of the day and have to untie my shoes. I did that in Greenland. That was not enjoyable. Hurt my Achilles and got to hobble for the next 40 miles. Don't recommend that. There you go. That's how to lace your boots quickly and efficiently in the winter. Uh, working efficiently but keeping your fingers warm and your feet warm in the winter is a challenge. But that's how I lace my boots to prevent tendon damage, Achilles damage, calf damage, work faster, your feet stay warm, and not have to release the laces and re-grab them. You want to keep them in your hands and cross, 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 and then cross, 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 tie and double knot them. It's way faster than letting go and letting go because it gets all awkward.